Spotify presents the ESPN Creek Info playlist of the day with me, Jason Dacey, ahead of the match on Wednesday in IPL 2019 as Bengaluru face up to Punjab. We've got some big names here, A.B. de Villiers, Mohamed Shami, Dale Stain, K.L. Rahul and the one and only Virat Kohli. This is the 42nd match of the IPL 2019 here in the studio. We have Ajit Agurka and also Sean Tate. Let's get straight to A.B. de Villiers and look at his record. When he plays for Bengaluru against Punjab, you know, a third of the times he goes to the crease, he gets a half century against these opponents. Yeah, I mean, he'd, they'd want him to do that again. I think uh, he's he's been a bit quiet, although he's got, uh, what, four half centuries. Mm. Uh, this IPL, he's been a bit quiet, uh, not, you know, you you kind of are so used to ABW players coming and winning a few games every season mm. uh, by himself. We haven't quite seen that uh, this year. So maybe now's the time uh, and uh, those numbers are... Uh, really good against this particular team. So, RCB must be hoping that uh, it's his night. Uh, it'll be fun to watch. Well, there's every chance that uh, Mohamed Shami will be bowling at the death. And let's have a look at his uh, figures in that period. Uh, strike rate and economy rate and wickets. What would you say about that, Sean? It's not bad. Um, look, he's, he's, a, he's a good bowler. This, this bloke's um, arguably... I mean, obviously there's Boomer as well, but arguably he's been India's best bowler for the yeah. last sort of six months, that, that type period. Um, World class. It seems to be in every format as well. Um, and he's obviously with Punjab's bowling attack. He's so important. He's a num number mm -hmm. one guy. Um, you take him out and it does look pretty thin. And with Dale Steyn there, it's uh, very exciting for RCB. The South African veterans come in and this is what he's doing in the power play at the moment. Yeah, I mean, they needed somebody. Uh, okay, when you get that sort of quality, you're always going to get some results. But uh, they needed a needed a experienced head, that attack. Uh, and who better to get than Dale Stain, who's obviously a lot hungrier, uh, having not been picked in the auction mm -hmm. by anyone, uh, gets an opportunity to play. Uh, tough place to bowl as well, Bengaluru. But he's got the, we've seen him over his career, he's got the quality. Uh, hopefully produces those numbers again, uh, which will help, uh, which will mean that uh, maybe one of Gail or uh, Rahul is uh, in his pockets. So yeah. uh, that is what RCB need tomorrow from him. And Sean, how do you compare Dale Stain now to, say, Dale Stain of 10, 15 years ago? Oh, well, it's hard. It's very difficult to compare, but he certainly uh, stood the test of time. Mm. Um, the way he looks stronger, he looks bigger than me right now. He's, he looks like he's put on a bit of beef, a bit of muscle, um, and he's still running in and bowling good pace as well. Like normally, you'd, you're thinking, okay, he might have dropped 10 Ks, but mm. um, he's still bowling good pace. Mm. Okay, not, not what he was, he won 50s. Um, but uh, hats off to him, it's uh, really impressive that he's gone on for this long. Yeah, and you mentioned Kale Rahul just before. Let's have a look at what he's doing in the, the middle overs. Uh, of course, they want him to be there uh, in this upcoming match, of course. Yeah, I think, uh, I mean, we keep always, there's a, always a debate about Kale Rahul and how good he is, and mm. we know how good he is. Uh, yeah, the strike rate's uh, pretty good. The average is really good. Uh, it's been picked in the World Cup squad as well, so yeah. that pressure's off him now. Uh, can play a bit freely. He's from uh, Bangalore, mm -hmm. uh, so uh, knows the ground pretty well. They need, they need those top two are so important uh, to Kings Eleven, Chris Gale and him. Mm -hmm. uh, and we've seen him uh, win a game in what Mumbai recently, uh, staying unbeaten. So. Uh, oh, sorry, got a hundred there. Yeah, 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 uh, didn't win the game, but got a hundred there. Help them uh, win. Yeah. Again, Mumbai. So he's got form. Mm. Hopefully, uh, and they need to win. Uh, Kings Eleven can't afford to win losses. And Sean, you mentioned the battle of the two Indian captains, Virat Kohli against R. Ashwin, and uh, we love seeing Virat in action. This is what he does against R. Ashwin in, in T20s domestically and in the IPL. Yeah, he's obviously um, got a little bit. Got a little bit up on him there, um, no doubt about that, which is not always easy to do. But uh, again, that, that clash between those two guys, mm -hmm. the two leaders, mm -hmm. there'll be a little bit of fire and a little bit of angst and all that sort of thing, which is always good for the game. Um, but yeah, now, I was mentioning, so we were talking about Coley, but mentioning K.O. Raul as well. Trying to get up with those big dogs, so Avery de Villiers and Coley, and especially when a, a guy like Raul's playing against Coley, he's going to want to step up as well. So mm -hmm. Coley also brings that, the, 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 the big, especially the big Indian players, but everyone wants to step up to that level that he's setting. Um, and be up there with the, with the runs and wickets as well. So the impact that he brings to the game anyway, um, the presence that he has, um, along with his, obviously his performance. Going to be good to watch all these superstars. Thank you very much to Sean Tate and Ajit Agurka. This has been Spotify Presents, the ESPN Craig Info playlist of the day. We'll see you again soon.